tātou, no mai ki te rangi pōtonga, ko Tālena tuku ngoa. Welcome to our Southern Skies for the month of August 2025. Let's take a look at what we can expect to see in our skies this month, along with other astronomical events to keep an eye out for. First up, evening sky highlights. It is your last good chance to spot Mars in the evening sky with the best times being earlier in August. The red planet is slowly slipping away, so if you haven't had a look yet, don't miss our planetary neighbour in the west after sunset. August is also a fantastic time to take in the Milky Way, stretching right overhead in glorious detail on clear nights. Try getting away from city lights to really take in the beauty of our own galaxy. Saturn is another treat this month. It rises in the east before midnight, climbing higher each night, and is absolutely worth a look through a telescope if you can get your hands on one. Now for some morning sky highlights. In the morning skies, Matariki still shines along with Puanga, Tautoru and Takarua in or around the constellation of Orion. So it's a lovely time to connect with the stars of our new year if you miss them in June or July. Venus and Jupiter are also visible, although they're sitting quite low on the horizon in the early hours. If you've got a clear view east, keep an eye out for these bright planets. And now for our moon phases this month. Our first quarter, the beginning of the Tamatia phase, is on the 2nd of August. Full moon, Rako Nui, on the 9th. The last quarter, our Tangaroa phase, is on the 16th of August this month. And our new moon, Hiro, is the 23rd. Special conjunctions for the month of August. So a conjunction is when two or more objects appear to pass each other in space from our perspective here on Earth. On the 4th of August, the moon and Rehua, that's Antares, or the father of Matariki's children, pair up in the evening. The moon meets Saturn on the 12th of August, right sight through some binoculars. Then a real treat, Venus and Jupiter come close together on the 13th of August. Stunning planetary conjunction low before sunrise, the moon and Matariki come together on the 17th of August. And on 26th of August, look for the moon alongside Mars in the west after sunset. In space news, the third ever confirmed object to have originated from outside our solar system, known as 3i Atlas is continuing to move through our cosmic backyard. The comet is currently between Mars and Jupiter and poses absolutely no threat to Earth. It's a busy month on the International Space Station. Four astronauts as part of the Crew-10 mission are set to return to Earth this month after spending close to six months in space. Their replacement, Crew-11, will be launching shortly after. The European JUICE mission, that's the Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, makes a flyby of Venus on 31st of August, using the planet's gravity to slingshot itself on its way to Jupiter. Here at Stardom this August, looking at a family favourite will be on this month in our planetarium, along with beyond the solar system, exploring the many weird and wonderful things in space. And the second in our new series, The Space Between, will be on August the 21st with our guest speaker Gina Cole, exploring the connections between science and fiction. That's all for now. Happy stargazing and we'll see you under the stars here at Stardom. Tātai ki te rangi, tātai ki te whenua. Ka kite anō.